Here comes the sun. About 10 more degrees and it really would be all right. But we're hanging in there at 61 on this breezy afternoon. Phillies are 10th in the league in hitting, 11th in runs, top seven in homers. And right now the Phillies have a bit of a different lineup against Mackenzie Gore. And uh, he was pumped on Monday, Franny. His fastball was getting up to 97. This young man has a chance to be a really good pitcher in Major League Baseball. He's got super stuff. Very, very good fastball. He's an aggressive with it. As the Phillies try to get above the 500 mark. They're at four and four, currently in second place behind the Atlanta Braves. Swing the ground ball at the first baseline. Gallo reached to his left, fields it. He was playing the line and takes it to the bag for the unassisted putout. As the former national, Trey Turner stands in. The kick and a payoff pitch to Turner. Swing and a miss. Elevates the fastball with some giddy up. And Trey Turner not real happy with himself. He knows that he put swung in a pitch that was uh, up out of the zone. Here's Bryce Harper. Overall, eight for 27, 296 in seven games with two doubles, three homers all in one game. Ground ball right side. Diving stop made by Garcia, and he just throws it to no man's land. And he really had no chance. Good job to get to it. And Harper is aboard with a two out single. Here is JT Ramuto. Broke his bat out toward the left side, run down by Vargas. Christopher Sanchez is 27 years of age, 24th career start. One and one in seven games, four starts against the Nats. Jacob Young, 0 for 2 yesterday. That's a well struck ball the other way. Jacob Young's first hit of the year in the big leagues, a single to right center. That's a sweet swing. You got to keep an eye on him because he does run well. Jesse Winker batting second. Runner goes. They haven't picked, but no throw by Harper. Even with the throw over, he had such a huge jump. Harper said, you know what? No way. I'm not going to throw it. The throw wasn't that good, and so Harper had to reach down to his left to catch it and didn't seem to get a good grip on the baseball. Winker, well hit. Great base. Good base running play by Young. The ball was in front of him. Runner at second with one out. Still in scoring position for Lane Thomas. Lane Thomas rams one out to center. Pache to his right. He'll show off the arm. Two out, Young still at second, and it's Joey Gallo, the batter. That one's lined out towards center field. Pache's coming oh, wow. on, makes the catch, glove side, and the inning is over. Spectacular play. I won't ask anymore why he plays so shallow. Alec Bohm leads things off as we go to the second inning. Perfect pitch. Needs it. Perfect changeup. Down and away. Everything set up great and then nailed it. No, he didn't, I guess. It's a bad miss by the crew chief. Ball four. First walk issued by Gore. Second base runner for the Phillies. Now Castellanos off to a slow start. One for his last 19. Four for 27 overall. 0 2. Bouncer up the middle. Getting to it. Little shovel. Well done, Vargas Garcia to Gallo. 6 4 3, the Nats, ninth double play. So now here is Merrifield. It's that one to right field, and that'll drop in for a base hit. And Edmundo Sosa coming up. There's a light drive out to left field, a base hit. Merrifield around third, heading for home. The throw by Winkers cut off, and the Phillies take a 1 0 lead. RBI single for Edmundo Sosa. Here's a little cutter that it stays in the middle of the plate, and Edmundo Sosa smokes it to left. And it comes with two men down here in the second inning. How about that contribution from the boys off the bench? Pache is 0 for 1. That's it. Hasn't played a whole lot. Fly ball right field. And Lane Thomas backs up a few steps. Edmundo Sosa forgot the outs. He was going halfway. It was good technique if there was one out or no outs. <laughs> Manessis, then Riley Adams, the catcher. Ildemaro Vargas, the shortstop. Here's the wind now with the pitch. Swing and a ball hit hard up the middle, right past Sanchez reaching down and on through into center field. So here's Riley Adams, the catcher. Ground ball to third. Baum off balance throw to second for one. That's all they'll get. And switch hitting Ildemar Vargas becomes the hitter. And swings and hits one of the air to deep center. Back is Pache, still back, way back, reaches out, off his glove for the over the shoulder catch as he bangs into the fence. To third base, Manessas, he will stop, pardon me, Adams will stop there. And in the second with a booming double. To straightaway center is Ildemaro Vargas. Here's Trey Lipscomb. Ground ball to third. Bohm's got it. He hesitates for a moment, comes home, and they get the runner coming home. That just seemed to be too easy. I mean, it could be second and third right now with two outs. Of it's so. not the right running play, I will tell you that. So now Luis Garcia gets the start against this left-hander. Garcia, base hit left side. Vargas around third. Moving really well. Ball offline. The Nats are back even. 
A two out stake for Luis Garcia. Sinker in and Luis Garcia inside out. Nice job. Short quick to the ball. Good jump by Elmar Vargas. And an easy send for Ricky Gutierrez, third base coach for the Nats. Top of the order. Jacob Young takes the 3 0 fastball on the edge. And that home plate umpire, Alfonso Marquez, you can hear him say, that's it. No more, no more. No more. Yeah, sensitive. Well, somebody's gone. Alfonso Marquez said several times, no more, no more, stop. I don't think it was Davey. It may have been Miguel Cairo. Whoever's right next to Davey. And Franny, this isn't all about just that pitch. This you goes know, back to the first inning. Yeah, this is more Mackenzie Gore and defending his guy and knowing that, hey, my guy's making his pitches too. How are we calling this? So it is Cairo who's been thrown out. And Alfonso's telling Miguel, you're classy. Marquez is not going to let this game continue until Cairo leaves. Ball four. And Jesse Winker up in a big spot here in a 1 1 game. Two out. Winker up the middle. Right side. Sosa. That's it for the Nets. Now Bryce Harper, who had an infield hit his first time up. Swain, it's poked in the air to shallow center. Long run in for Young. He's going to run it down. Schwarber's halfway to second. The throw to first. Gallo the stretch. It's a double play. Schwarber got too far off base. Young makes a running catch. Throws on the run to first. Gallo the long stretch holds the bag. And that'll be a double play to end the inning. Here comes the payoff. And Thomas takes a ball down and outside. There goes Thomas. Throw to first. Harper's going to throw down. The tag is not in time. The Nats have done it again. Two stolen bases on pickoff throws. Manessis had a single to center. Manessis, he's got a base hit. Thomas had to retreat. He's going to get sent by Ricky Gutierrez, and he will score without a play. And there is an RBI attached to Joey's second hit of the day. The Nats are on top. Well, slider stays up in the zone. Where does Joey make his money? That is right, up the middle. Lane, easy score for him. Alec Bohm walked his first time up. Strike three. Alec Bohm doesn't walk this time. Questioned by Bohm on his way back to the dugout. So Gore has strikeout number three, and that was a big pitch on three and two. Castellanos just one out of his last 20. And a strike three call. That was a good pitch. I think he just fooled him. Back to back strikeouts. Five in a row set down by Gore. Edmundo Sosa drove him the Phillies run with a single to left. Oh, well oh, that ball's hit well. Sosa drives one to deep left center field. Going back is Young. It is gone. Five rows back at Mundo Sosa. His first home run of the year. He's tied this game up at two. I just marvel at this guy. He has been such a great addition to this ball club. He seems to impact the game every single time he gets a chance to play. And I, I know as a bench player, that is a very difficult thing to do. Adams had a. Home run to tie the game here in the Nationals home opener up in a big spot with the bases loaded. Here's the pitch swing and a line drive left field moving over is Merrifield he makes the catch runner tags Thomas coming home the throw will go to third cut off by Trey Turner. Trey Turner. Oh up against the wall Jesse Winker it just stayed in he took care and it's a dramatic first out in the top of the ninth. Strike! Three call, game over. And Kyle Finnegan, after one of the roughest days of his career, a week ago today, comes back to save both wins on this homestand.